repair droid sector. Regional training at Nuneaton is a small but significant expansion for Thatcham. Perhaps a more exotic one is the establishment of a small office in Thailand. Well, Thatcham sent me out to Thailand because they felt being in the center of Asia Pacifica area, it was a better country for a base. They call it the Asian Corridor, so it makes it very easy to commute to these, these other countries. How's it going over there? With manufacturers where actual work is to look at their cars and, and work out a good method of anti-theft, whether it be the door handle or whether it's a steering column. We're in the social climate we live in. Car theft in lots of other countries is on the rise. And so we have a criteria here, which is a very, very strict criteria. And we try to apply this to the manufacturers, especially in the consultancy work we do in Japan. This allows us to bring uh, more secure vehicles to the UK. I'm very proud to represent the company and to go out there and to be at the forefront of vehicle technology for Thatcham. Yeah, Thatcham UK. I want us, we are recognised as the best in the West. I want us to be the best in the East. Everything Thatcham does benefits motor insurers and therefore, eventually, the motorist. Group rating is a very direct service provided for motor insurers. I mean, what a manufacturer is trying to do here is achieve a low insurance group rating. And the car has to behave well in a 15 kilometre per hour impact yep. on the front and on the rear. So is this about safety or cost of repair or, or what? This is about cost of repair. I mean, it's not to do with safety because it's low speed. It's only 15 kilometres per hour. We don't expect to see much damage into the car that would really affect the passengers. So it is about repairability on the car and cost of the parts because something like 60% of all claims are down to cosmetic repairs. And you set the rating here at Thatcher? We put all the information together we have a, um, a panel of insurers and there's about 12 insurers on that panel and they're the ones who actually calculate or, or allocate the final rating. We put all the rating information together for them. And then from a manufacturer's point of view, if he can get the cost of ownership down for the motorist, then they're going to pay less premium and then he may be better than his competitors. So if they can keep the cost of their damage down in the 15 kilometre per hour impact, then they're going to get a better insurance group. So how do you work with vehicle manufacturers to actually get them a better group rating? They may be looking at this vehicle and produce prototypes maybe six months prior to launch. So we'll go and look at those prototypes and we'll probably help them in looking at their design and how well it's going to do in security and in the repair of that vehicle. And what's the benefit to the insurers? The benefit to the insurers is a car that's repairable hopefully and you know low costs. It, we, we monitor the cost of the parts prices so the group rating helps to keep the parts prices down as well. So the more we can help reduce those costs and improve security on the vehicle and so on, it helps reduce the claims cost to the insurance industry. Now Thatcham really is a big name in this area, so much so it's actually called after the town it was built in. Ian, you're heavily involved in community relations here. What are you doing for the people locally? I think we do quite a lot, Dan. Uh, we've had the local schools visit Thatcham and they've attended the, some crashes in the crash facility. I go out to local schools, I give the Thatcham message, tell them a bit about who we are. We try to give them again the safety message. Uh, we've given a grant to uh, the local community hospital uh, to help them uh, in a project that they were doing last year. We do a lot of recycling. We, we like to be environmentally friendly and we're recycling about 80 tonnes of waste a year, which uh, before that we would send to landfill. So I think we're doing quite a lot locally. So Ian, what's with the turbines spinning away behind us? Uh, we're a, a pioneering site for that really, Dan. We're the first in the area to get this number of wind turbines. Um, it helps us um, supplement um, our energy supply. It means we're buying less energy from the grid. Um, the idea is that certainly at evenings and weekends we will be self-sufficient in generating energy and therefore obviously you know, environmentally friendly as well. As I've been talking to the staff here at Thatcham, I've been hearing a lot about the Thatcham BSI kite mark. The man probably most responsible for taking this forward is Jason Mosley. I think the kite mark has given Thatcham uh, an even greater focus on, on, on the needs of the, of the industry. And it's really united the industry in, in a drive towards more uh, efficient and safe repairs. I think the specific benefits to insurers is that they 
we'll be dealing with businesses who have the kite mock, who have the basic skills to do a safe and quality job. I think that's very important from an insurer risk point of view. And given our, our, our base knowledge of understanding, we're able to articulate that perfectly well f for insurers and provide them with real measurable tools that, can, that they can use within their business to, to really make a difference in their businesses. So I think from their point of view, there's never been a, a better time to get value out of Thatcham. Tell us a bit more about Thatcham's accreditation work. Yeah, Thatcham has been looking at uh, its accreditation processes uh, and one of the things we want to provide is, is clear guidance to all our stakeholders to, that they can identify which products they can, they can safely procure uh, that will meet their needs and, and what we're doing is setting the benchmark with TQA to say this is, this is the stamp that you need to look for on products, and particularly security products, that will deliver what you expect. Thatchim continues to make it a big difference here in the United Kingdom, but what about overseas? Well, you're absolutely right. We do have a very big influence here in the UK. Um, we're funded by insurers and we obviously look after their interests. We also look after the interests of repair and ultimately the interests of you and I, the motorist. Overseas, we're seeing people realise the centre of excellence that Thatcham really is. We are looking into areas of crash repair driven by NCAT ratings and safety, vehicle security and also personal injury uh, claims. And we see a lot of people from around the world thinking, actually, we like some of the expertise that Thatcham have. So for us going forward, I can see growing in the UK, growing in Europe, but also growing worldwide. Well, that was Thatcham. And having met some of the 140 or so men and women that work here, I now know why it's got a growing global reputation. This dedicated team of specialists drives home innovation, improvements in car design, in crash repair and in security. Funded by the British insurance industry for the last 40 years, Thatcham is really making a difference. And I, for one, get in my car tonight to drive home, feeling that bit safer than I did when I arrived.